What's up, guys and goddesses? It's your girl, See the Spiritual Goddess, here for your monthly forecast for the month of October. So basically, I'm going to give you what the spirits want you to know, what your ancestors want you to know going in for the month of October, and what you can expect. Okay, Aries, let's get into your reading. I love me some Aries, so we about to get into your reading and see what the spirits, what message the spirits want me to give you for the month of October. So let's go ahead and get into it. Don't forget, if you do want a personal reading from me, I do have a, have a special going on. Check that in the description box. So let's go ahead and get into this reading. Spirits, what message do you want me to give to Aries for the month of October? What is the message? Alright, Aries, this is what I have for you. And it's funny because I know an Aries that this reading can go specifically to. <laughs> you got the Two of Pentacles. You see, it looks like they're juggling. Um, the Four of Cups in reverse and the Queen of Rods in reverse. So, this reading is telling me a lot of things. Right now, it looks like um, you are juggling a lot right now. Aries, there's a lot on your plate right now that you're juggling. Um, there's a lot of changes where there's some of you is you're juggling jobs. This person know who I'm talking about when I say this. You're juggling jobs, or you might be. Um, I see some of you juggling two relationships for some reason. I see some of you entertaining somebody else and trying to keep it on the low. Um, some of you is just, you just dating multiple people. Some of you are making new changes um, in the month of October. Um, you may be, this could also represent like, this is a new change. Things are about to get hectic for you. Um, um, as a result though, what the Four of Cups is telling me, um, is that with all these changes, that's happening fast and with juggling everything, um, you it you really need to sit down and rest. It, I feel like you're out of whack because you're not getting the proper rest that you need. You're not meditating. Things are happening so fast and it's making you kind of resentful. Some of you are slipping down to a path of de depression because of everything that's happening. And um, the spirits are telling me to tell you, you need to start taking it easy. You need to get your rest. Um, this that you're doing, what you're, what you're doing is setting you up for the future. But you need to probably, uh, you probably need to lighten the load. Um, for those of you who this, this represents love and relationships, you need to really reflect on who you really need to be with. I feel like... You're, some of you are just having your cake and eating it too. You're causing, but it's, this is starting to wear you down. For those of you that it's career-wise, maybe it's time to, um, you know, lighten the load with your job. Um, I do see Queen of Rods is telling me things are about to get more hectic for you. So you really need to... Take some time off. I, I see some of you who need to take a vacation. Uh, maybe think about um, Aries. Maybe um, going to like a sauna or something. Like you need some type of times for reflection. I don't know why I'm getting reflection for a lot of these readings um, here for the month of October. Um, it could mean because we're coming up on the new year. But things are about to start getting hectic. And if you don't get your rest... You're going to be out of whack and you're going to take on too much and you, you're going to shut down whether it's mentally, um, spiritually, some of you are going to, uh, I, I see some of you, um, if you don't really lighten the load, you're going to need to seek medical attention. Um, I don't see it being like really anything like too serious, but it's going to be something linked to stress. So... You need to lighten the load. You need to really sit down and reflect. If you can't, try taking you a spiritual shower, spiritual bath. I do have a video coming up talking about spiritual showers and spiritual baths and what's, what the purpose is, the general purpose. So start take, I would say take you one of those. Um, if you have some time, um, take a ride somewhere. Um, go by the water. Go to some places that really just, you know, make you think. That's what I would suggest. Meditation is key. 
So there you have it. I hope you guys enjoyed this reading, um, Aries. So let me know what you guys think about it. Leave a comment. Um, also, um, to get more into the special that I have going on for personal readings for uh, for the month of October, I am doing a five dollar. Uh, five dollar special where you can ask me one question you have to be very specific so if you want a general reading that's it's a different price but you can ask me one question uh, via text and you will get that for five dollars also if you want a phone reading I do um, have a special where you get five dollars off 30 minute phone call reading making that twenty five dollars so you can definitely take advantage of that um, also, I do have a $10, um, special going on for everyone, um, $10 for a three to five questions if you want to ask, ask that. Um, but yeah, make sure you take advantage of that. Also, make sure you follow me on my Facebook. I do have a meditation challenge that I'm going to be posting up soon that I, that I think can be really good for you, Aries. So I'll leave all the details there. So make sure you follow that, okay? So, until then, um, gods and goddesses, see you in the next video. Peace.